Good morning, Life Church. Above all else, guard your heart, for from it comes the wellspring of life. Proverbs chapter 4, verse 23. Above all else, guard your heart. For me, this year is one of those significant milestone birthdays, and I'm not going to tell you which one it is. But if I could look back and if I could speak to my 18 year old self, then for sure, one of the things that I would say is, Adrian, above all else, guard your heart, for from it comes the wellspring of life. It's of first importance. In the Bible, your heart is your inner self. It's your true self. In spiritual terms, it's in our hearts that Christ dwells through faith. Guard your heart. For from it comes the wellspring of life. It's the heart that determines life's direction. It's my heart that determines who I am, what I do and the impact that I have on the people and the world around me. Another proverb says, as water reflects a face, so a man's heart reflects the man. Therefore, Let's take care what goes into our hearts, what we watch and what we listen to. Take care of what our hearts dwell on, our thoughts, our motivations, our attitudes. And let's take care of who rules our hearts. At the heart of the Christian gospel is the promise of a new heart. By God's grace and in his love and mercy, he gives us a new heart, a new start. If anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. The old has gone and the new has come. And so today, church, may we in whatever situation we find ourselves and through whatever circumstances we face, may we above all else guard our hearts and may we set apart Christ as Lord in our hearts. Amen.